Hey, welcome back everybody. We are continuing on again with the case of Monarch First Edition. Uh, we'll go with this box here. We are on box three of four. I love opening cases of this stuff. Love opening cases of First Edition. Um, <clears throat> should already have some videos up um, on my channel for Crucible of War. Uh, I'm recording this prior to me opening the Crucible of War, but talked in some previous videos that uh, that I'm uploading that I'll be getting those Crucible videos up after those. So I will probably upload those after uh, or upload these videos after the Crucible. But hopefully you liked my Crucible videos. Hopefully I got something good in them and only had to open one of the two cases like to keep one sealed. Um, did find out, and I'll probably talk about it in the Crucible videos. All right, first Majestic of the box, Genesis. Um, did find out, because I was a little, uh, a little thrown off by one box, or one case having just clear tape, and a second case having the white safety tape. Uh, all right, Valiant Thrust, I need that for my Bolton deck. Um, I was a little thrown off because the uh, the one didn't and was trying to inspect it and didn't see didn't appear that somebody had removed the the, the tape from it but found out uh, watching watching another video and of uh, somebody cracking online um, fab unsealed was watching their videos and saw that uh, or they were talking about crucible as they were cracking through a case and the guy brought up the uh, brought up the fact that they had two two waves of the first uh, first edition print run. First wave, the boxes only, or the boxes were sealed with clear tape, um, or the cases, I'm sorry, were sealed with clear tape, and in the second wave, when those came out, those were sealed with the safety, the white safety tape, so. All right, uh, foil rare, captain's call, and a shadow of Urser. I'll make Majestic number two of the box. So, I was a little worried at first, but uh, just kind of hunting through some of it, other videos and watching people open. Just wanted to see if uh, see if they were opening cases with, uh, with clear tape on them. Um, and came to a more recent video that he had, uh, or that they had un uh, uploaded, and they were talking about it, and Apparently, too, the, uh, the the pack configuration is a little different on that first print uh, print run of the Crucible first edition, um, where the cold foil and regular rainbow foils are the last card in the pack, and in the others they were here in the second wave or print run. Yeah, second wave of the first edition. They were third from the back, so. All right, another uh, rainbow foil rare. Glisten, not bad. Love to see that, uh, see that foil majestic, or see uh, see a cold foil here. Hoping to hit some hotness with a cold foil. Uh, all right, rainbow, another rare. Uh, be number four in the box. I think I've been averaging about uh, five of those, averaging about seven total majestics between regular or non-foil rainbow foil and cold foil for the boxes so hoping to kind of match some of those numbers through the rest of the case on these last two boxes looking a little slow on the uh on the majestics in this box though so hopefully there's some hotness at the end of uh end of this box Another rainbow rare or rainbow coal common geez oh man and uh dimensional uh, gateway or dimensional crossroads wow about uh about a third of the box left after this pack here so uh, smash with big tree common and two more regular rares Cell spelting, another common, and two more rares in the back. Come on, let's see some of the hotness already here. It's, uh, it's been a 
disappointing box so far. Hell yes. Still needed that bad boy. Cold foil legendary. Vestige of soul. Get that sleeved up and even a majestic in there. All right. That, uh, this guy here made up for the, made up for the slowness of the box. That's still one that I needed for my set as well. So I think I just need one more legendary. Look at that. Get, uh, get some of that shine going for you. Blind you in the process. Yeah, there you go. Three lights above me. You can see all three of them. There you go. Awesome. All right. Well, like I said, that uh, that that makes up for the uh, the slowness of the box. This, uh, actually, this case so far has been good for good to me on cold foils. It's been down to about uh, about eight or so cold foils that I've needed, and I think so far all three boxes I've hit uh, hit a cold foil that uh, that I've needed for my set. So I'll uh, I'll take it. All right. That gives us our fifth. Rainbow foil, uh, rare, and our fifth non-foil majestic. So not Arcanix. And it's another uh, common foil. And just a couple more majestics to uh, to really round this out and make this a great great box. See, uh, see if we can get ourselves a rainbow foil here. It can happen. I've cracked, uh, I have cracked two cold foils in a box of this before, so would love to see a second cold foil, but not, uh, not a guarantee. I'm not holding my breath. I think the, uh, the the legendary was enough, but I mean, oddly enough, it was a uh, a common cold foil, and then the last pack of the box cracked the uh, the cold foil of the Valiant Dynamos, so can happen that, uh, that that you get lucky enough to hit a cold foil, or a uh, regular, or a common cold foil, and then a legendary cold foil. Haven't seen a Majestic and a Legendary, or two Legendaries, or Legendary and Fabled, so I guess I don't have much of a sample size since I've only done it once, so. Oh, alright, awesome. That uh, that makes it worth it. <laughs> Damn, that's uh, that's two foil uh, soul shields and a tome of divinity. That gives us our two two four six. That's our seventh majestic, six regular non foil, one rainbow foil. This box has been soulful. Vestige of soul. It's our second soul shield and a soul food. All right, well, all right. Gives us eight, uh, yeah, two, four, six, seven regular, regular majestics, one foil majestic, and of course, that cold foil legendary. That looks really nice. All right, well, uh, <clears throat> if you like the videos, hit the like button for me, appreciate it. Um, if you haven't yet, feel free to subscribe. Wouldn't mind getting a few more subscribers and let you know when uh, when I do get uh, or when I am uploading more content. I'm trying to hit uh, every other day at least to upload some videos. So be on the lookout. We'll have more coming. And uh, thanks for your support. Have a good one.